Clan, Bombo Clan. Welcome to our J Crazy News headlines and a special Sunday evening to those who are watching this news broadcast. Now to my viewers and my subscribers. To this generation, let me make this very clear. When you see a person having the most expensive vehicle, that big house on Jack's Hill, and Beverly Hill and you're wishing to yourself if only I could live that life but my friends my viewers and my subscribers you'll be amazed shocked and surprised of the things that you do behind the scenes in secret to live or maintain that certain life and those persons I'm talking about they are big business men and women in Jamaica and other individuals such as TikTokers. A lot of these so-called businessmen and women, their regular earnings from their business cannot maintain their organization to a consistent manner. So many of them have to live a life of illegal activities and that illegal activity is taking part in the smuggling of the white lady. Yes, my viewers and my subscribers, many businessmen who own hardware, supermarkets, wholesale, etc. In Jamaica, many of them are taking part in smuggling the white lady and they get money from it and you wonder how the hell them can buy a Lamborghini or a Ferrari or other top tier motor vehicles it's not their daily earning monthly or yearly earning from their business no it's because they are taking part in the smuggling of drugs. You will notice every time the police sees the white lady well, on a boat by the wharf, etc. No one ever get arrested because big businessmen Politicians are behind it. And what's sad, the JCF know too. But because these white collar criminals are above the law in Jamaica, all these things go undetected, go under the radar. And they make it look like, say, I only get to people do crime. When the upper class, they're involved in all kinds of illegal activities. Murder, guns for drug trade, as well as smuggling the white lady. Now, yesterday I did a video on the murder of Dean Shaw. I had many speculations. Many persons had many speculations. But one speculation stood out to me was the recent white lady bus in Haven Deal St. Andrew which was worth 12 billion Jamaican dollars five men were arrested including a accountant and a Colombian national the Colombians are not happy. They are mad. They are very, very angry. And because of this, white lady boss, many persons 
are going to lose their life. Sad to say. Now, I won't put the information I received in this video because it's from an unknown source. However, what I've got, everything seems to add up. Now, the CEO of Phil's Hardware along Constant Spring Road. I won't call the person's full name. But the person who owns that hardware. Based on information, it's alleged yesterday when your friend Dean Shaw was killed, you cried. You wept. But you knew why he was killed. Now, based on information I receive, your name is also on the hit list. Yes, your name is also on the hit list. So, the person who owns Phil's hardware along Constant Spring Road, I'm just giving you a heads up on what is to come because you are also on the list to be taken out by the hitmen. There's also a female who is a TikToker. Her name starts with T. I'll only say T. Now, Miss T, based on information that I receive, it's alleged that your baby father is mixed up in drugs. And that you also own a hair salon. And based on information I've got, the hitmen have you on the list as well. They know when you close your shop and also what time you go to the bank. Now, I said before, you're on the hit list. Because based on information, your baby father now stop teeth up the white lady. Money. And I know that you have a young child. So I'm just giving you a word of caution. A head start on what is to come. And seek what a protection you can get. Because your baby father involvement is why you are on the hit list. To the JCF, my viewers and my subscribers, we know say, they may not believe vloggers as usual. But vloggers always have them ears to the streets and they know what time it is. All I can say to these two persons, take my word of caution and advice. And other persons who know within themselves so they mix up in this $12 billion white lady bus last week in Haven, dear St. Andrew. Get yourself some protection. Now we head towards the parish of Manchester in three chains to be exact, where a farmer was shot and killed yesterday afternoon. Now dead is Fabian Dixon, otherwise called Primi, of Three Chains Address. Now around 3.50 p.m. yesterday afternoon, all explosions were heard in the community. After the smoke was cleared and the police was summoned, Fabian Dixon was seen lying in a pool of blood face down. Fabian Dixon died in hospital. 
So far, there's no motive as to why he was murdered. The police are investigating. Now we head towards St. James in Cambridge, where a man known as Dino was killed by criminal elements sometime yesterday. Now, info is very sketchy. However, update you the next news broadcast. This is Jay Crazy. Until then, this is safe Sunday evening. Yeah man, I'm here see a black legend. I'm here represent for Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. So watch, like, comment, subscribe, and share out the thing. Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. In review news and entertainment. Celebrity lifestyle movements as well. Jay Crazy my play when he my review the thing then. Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. In review news and entertainment. Celebrity lifestyle movements as well. Jay Crazy my play when he my review the thing then. Review the thing them, review the thing them Check crazy Reviewing news, entertainment and celebrity lifestyle Review the thing them, review the thing them Check crazy